Well, you might call it uh, another difficult week for the Premier. Christy Clark's former Solicitor General crossed the floor to join the Conservatives. A new poll came out suggesting she's the second most unpopular Premier in Canada. And now today, her finance minister says he may not seek re-election. But Deputy Premier Kevin Falcon, who ran for the Liberal leadership himself just a year ago, says this has nothing to do with party popularity. Stephen Andrew has the story. An election is a year away, but not every Liberal MLA is committed to another term. There's a whole bunch of issues that you, uh, you also have to factor into the final decision that you make. Deputy Premier and Finance Minister Kevin Falcon is openly pondering his future as an MLA. I am not at all um, concerned about the fact that we happen to be temporarily down in the polls. And in fact, the last poll showed some increase and some improvement. But Falcon says his comments should not be construed as doubts about Premier Clark's leadership. Falcon says his decision is largely based on the time he spends away from his family as finance minister. But he acknowledges that time would be far greater had he won the leadership and become premier. And his comments are also surprising since he was the leadership candidate that was calling out his rival Christy Clark, asking her if she was going to stick around should she lose the leadership bid. The special prosecutor. Falcon's comments do not come at a good time for the Liberals. Just two days after, former Solicitor General John Van Doggen resigned from the government to become a member of the B.C. Conservative Party. John's dealing with his. And Other Liberal MLAs are also considering their future. What plays into my decision is, do I want to spend some more time with my family and, you know, sit back and enjoy retirement? And this week, former Solicitor General Kashid also dropped hints about a coming announcement on his career. I'll make a decision too in the near future, like many of us will make decisions in the future. But while some are deliberating, others are standing firm. Kevin will make his decisions, and I'm happy for him to do that. But uh, you know that I am committed uh, to this party and this leader. But with the government down in the polls... I'm working as hard as I possibly can. And a premier with her own popularity dropping daily, that may not be good enough. Stephen Andrew, CTV News, Victoria.